Sheikah, girl, this previous episode of Bring It was on some bullshit, child. The whole episode was on some shit. Then they had the nerve and the gall to try to take us to church after the bullshit. I know that's right, Diana and them. Y'all, y'all better uh, try to get people's souls together. But why y'all let it? Y'all need to get y'all together in the process, girl, because this episode gave stunts and shows. But I'm going to tell you who I was here for. I was here for little Miss Deja. Deja straight up told Dana, Deja said, bitch, I ain't want to do it. I know that's right, Deja. Go in and let her But personally, I feel like y'all got that option to say what y'all do want to do and what the fuck y'all don't want to do. Girl, Diana got all up in her feelings and got all upset, mad, and went insane in the membrane, all because Faith and three other girls went out for the damn. Well, let me start over. They was going to a competition this weekend where the competition consists of live music and Diana wanted to do a liturgical dance ministry. Now, listen, I was a praise dancer. I was a praise dancer for a few years. I was a mime dancer for a few years, and I'm all here for that. However, girl, this is a major competition. OK, and, and then on top of that, this is a public event. You don't know who the fuck in there are atheists and, and Muslims and 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 uh Buddhists and Islam and everything else. Like y'all done already did that shit one time before and got second place. I don't know why in the fuck y'all thought it was a good idea to do that again. Well let me not say y'all. I don't know why Diana thought it was a good idea to do that shit again. There's just some some situations just don't call for situations such as that. And while I'm glad that you got a quickening in your spirit because you needed it. Too bad the judges won't move because, bitch, your ass show sure enough got second place. But um, for what it was worth, I thought it was really good. Um, D. Thick Pen, y'all know him. He's from, um, well, I know him from Desi when he was Desi on uh, Medea Go to Hell. I ain't know nothing about he won Sunday's best because I went into that dry, fake-ass, hypocritical-ass show. I went in there, girl. Just shit, to let me tell it, none of the winners that won that shit did a goddamn thing, but I guess he's one of the lucky few that actually made it out after that shit. Um, but it was good to see him. He could sing his ass off. So it was good to see him, and he was looking good, too, with his fine ass. Yes, Selena was all up on my man. Bitch, Selena, get your ass off my man, girl. He don't want you. Um, and Selena, it was good to see you, too, bitch, because I was confused. I didn't know where the fuck you was at. Like, I think, what? You was gone for what? Two episodes? Ain't nobody been seeing you. My subscribers is hitting me up asking me where the fuck you been, bitch. Out of hell, I know, girl. I don't know none of these people personally, but bitch, I'm glad to see you back. I'm glad to see that you still alive and Diana ain't run your ass off. Um, what else went on in this damn episode? Like I said, Diana running out there quitting and all of that shit, beating her chest like she fuck a Donkey Kong, stomping them wide ass feet the fuck out that damn studio. Like, Diana, let me tell you something. And I said this in the previous video. You ain't got no class or no grace in any type of situation, none at all whatsoever. I mean, bitch. I can understand you being upset because only three people went up for the solos, but goddamn. Was it really that motherfucker serious that you had to go through all of that shit? It really wasn't. And then you sitting up there talking about some robber was the one that um got in your head and, and, and said something about he ain't never known you to quit. He ain't never known you to get up and walk out and leave stuff unfinished. This and then the third bitch, please. Pilgrim Studios and Lifetime called your ass and said, bitch, you still on the motherfucking contract. So unless you want to uh, give us our money for a breach in the contract, you better have your ass in the motherfucking building, bitch. Tell the goddamn truth, Diana. Tell the truth. Shame the devil. Um, what else went on? Uh, like I said, y'all, that was pretty much all that went on. Um, the ooh, babies, the babies, baby dancing dolls was in the car loud rounds this time, and all three of them did a really, really, really great job. They actually won the car loud round as a as a whole. So congratulations, baby dancing dolls. Y'all be doing y'all thing as usual with y'all little cute selves. Um, congratulations to the dolls. Um, even though y'all came in second, I still thought it was really good. I can appreciate it because I am a Christian, a cousin Christian, but a Christian nonetheless. 
But, you know, y'all just have to be careful because we living in a time where, you know, some stuff is just not ex- accept- acceptable in certain situations. And, you know, considering the fact that that was a major red dance competition, won't no need for y'all to go down that road again. Y'all done been there, done that, and y'all done fucked around and got second place again. Um, Tyrus was there. Tyrus and his team was there. It was good to see you, Tyrus. Hey, girl. Um, and you did a good job this time, Tyrus. Uh, he went out there and danced with this girl's bitch. He did a jump split and everything. And got up after the jump split. Go in and let have Tyrus. I go up for Tyrus. I go in for him. And his team did a really, really good job. Like, y'all have definitely, like, stepped it up a lot, Elite Stars in Nashville. Y'all stepped it up a lot. If ain't nobody never told y'all, I'm going to tell y'all. Y'all stepped it up a lot. And y'all made it do what it was supposed to do. Um, explosive. It was good to see y'all. Uh, Sharkeitha, hey girl, you know I live for Sharkeitha. It was good to see her too. She won a loud mouth this time. Girl, she got all up in, uh, through the spirit her damn self, her and Tyrus. Um, which was good. It was good to see everybody rally up together. Even the girls and the teams and the coaches, you know, the coaches came over there and was hugging Diana and stuff. You know, I think it was good because that's what they needed to get over this hump. They needed a little bit of divine intervention and all of that shit because, girl, with the way Diana stormed the fuck up out of that damn dollhouse, I ain't know what the hell was going on. Talking about she was just going to close this, her debt studio down and keep up with the damn Birmingham studio and the studio in Atlanta. Child, I guess. If that's what the fuck you feel you need to do that, then by all means, boo-boo. Um, that's really all that went on. Oh, bitch, one more thing. Brittany, girl, get a better storyline, Brittany. Brittany, please get a better storyline. I'm so sick of hearing y'all bitches with y'all broke down, dusty ass uteruses that don't work. I don't know what in the fuck to do. We had to deal with that shit on basketball wives, deal with that shit on love and hip hop. Now we got to turn around and deal with this shit with you, girl. Child, please. Girl, if you don't get your ass out there, get you a man and do that shit the, the hard way like everybody else do, you had better. Um... Lord, I'm trying to see what else, because didn't nothing really go on on this episode, girl, besides the whole blow up at the dollhouse. That's really all that the episode centered around. And um, Brittany trying to have a goddamn baby. Uh, girl, I still say you need to wait until you find you a man and then go on ahead and do that shit. Like, you don't want to be walking around with some foreign ass man uh, nut all up in you, girl. Especially since you not ugly and you really can't pull your man, Brittany. Just quit being lazy and find your man, girl. A good man this time. Um, that was pretty much it, y'all. I I I can't I can't squeeze nothing else up out of this damn watermelon. That's all I got. I ain't got no more. Like I said, the episode. Yeah, I could have took it or left it. Um. I guess we're just going to have to wait to see what next we give. Hopefully, it's going to be some better than what the fuck they've been giving us. But, girl, I doubt it. But I'm about to get the hell up off of here, child, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.